On the first Saturday in December since 1988, an all-volunteer group has come together to place and light 23,110 luminaries on the battlefield at Antietam to honor the sacrifices made on that hallowed ground. In 23 years, the volunteers have respectfully placed and lighted over 500,000 candles. On Saturday evening, September 15th, the organizers of the annual Antietam Illumination will join with the Living History community to create a special illumination of 3,654 candles on the reenactment battlefield in remembrance of the American soldiers who made the ultimate sacrifice on September 17, 1862 in the farm fields just south of the reenactment site along the Sharpsburg Pike and Antietam Creek. Parts of the reenactment field will represent the five main phases of the battle. The cornfield, where the battle commenced at dawn, the west woods, the sunken road, the Burnside Bridge, and the final attack of A.P. Hill and his light division that concluded the carnage as the sun set that day. We will be creating the luminaries with the Antietam candle, made by the Root Candle Company of Medina, Ohio, which has supplied every candle placed and lighted on the Antietam battlefield for the past 23 years. Starting Thursday morning, volunteers will be putting together the 3,654 luminaries in the Illumination Station, located in the Green Farm Building directly behind the reenactment battlefield. Look for the sign and the Maryland flag and join in and help us create this unique tribute. Come spend an hour or two. We will be able to use your help Thursday through Saturday, 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. to create this tribute to freedom and human rights. This will be the first time that an illumination commemoration has been produced on this scale at any Civil War reenactment. Join in the history. Call 443-286 one nine three three if you need additional information.